Hi, how are you? I'm Zita, your guiding luminary. Thank you for joining me today on my daily reading. Today I'll be using the Wisdom of the Oracle by Colette Baron reed to do my reading. And if this is your first time here, welcome. I'm a life coach and I use Oracle cards and crystals to help clients unblock um, blockages, uh, get away, get rid of any negativity, and also to help clear with crystals. So depending where the blockage may be, I assign different crystals for healing. So today I shuffle before coming live and uh, what I normally do is I shuffle and then I wait for a card or two to flip or jump and today two cards popped. The card on the left being the thinker and the second card all that glitter. So you can see the person is really really thinking very intensely there's a lot of stars all around her helping her and the message today is that you're in a position right now to start thinking about what you want to do next what are your next steps it's a good time to do a plan um, I'm a marketing consultant by trade as well so what I normally do is I do a strategic plan for my marketing activities and sales activities for the year. So you're being encouraged to think and to plan what to do next. And what's really interesting is that this card is assigned a number 44, which is very angelic. So the angel that's there is going to help you with your planning and your strategy because whatever you're going to try to manifest is going to be very, very profitable for you, very abundant. So that's what's going to be very important that you think things clearly and when you do your plan be it for a relationship um, you want to start a family you want to buy a home think carefully and don't just think of money money is very nice and that is beautiful and that's what the glitter on the right represents you can see there's a person here who's going to help you amass the wealth you so much desire. But remember, wealth is not just measured by glitterly stuff, jewelry, fancy clothes, uh, fancy cars or homes. Glitter, make sure it doesn't take away from your purpose in life. Yes, it's nice to have a plan to start a family or start a business and uh, try to make some money. But if that's your sole driving force, it's not going to make you happy. That's why on the mat, on the card you see these two masks. So don't cover your intentions or don't expect the desires to come true and make you happy. If you're looking beyond by wearing this mask, simply thinking that money will make you happy, new jewelry, new car, that next, next, next thing that glitters will make you happy. You need to be happy within. So look deeply within today reflect on what you really want what is your heart's desire and if you look I put a whole bunch of crystals the first on the left is a uh, quartz clear quartz to clear any negativity there's labor right to help you think and envision with your third eye there's a rose quartz to look into your heart what do you really want the amethyst beautiful purple is planted there as well to help you think and connect with the divine energy to guide you so you can speak your truth with aquamarine crystal and the other two to bring you prosperity and love and completion so if you feel better and you have a direction where you're going so i hope this video resonated with you please like and subscribe to my channel to help it grow if you'd like a personal reading feel free to reach out to me my information is in the description below love and light god bless have a great day and thank you.